everyone, it's Darcy Lacouve here with Android Authority and we're taking a first look at the Samsung Galaxy S4 and we're going to be doing an unboxing for you today. Now just to be clear, this is the Snapdragon 600 powered variant. Uh, it actually features a beautiful box that we thought was actually made with wood when we first opened it up. As you can see, it really matches the table. The box itself is made of 100% recyclable material uh, with organic ink and we really, really have to commend Samsung for their choice. Saving the planet is always something we all aspire to do. As you can see, this one is fully sealed here. And so this is going to be the first time we're going to be doing an unboxing for you. So let's cut it open and see what's inside. Moment of truth. Oh, that hurts. There we go. A little bit difficult. <laughs> Broke the pencil. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Okay, let's see what's inside. And as we can see, we have a nice manual here from Samsung. This contains some stuff that really we don't care about. Oh, and here is the device itself. Very difficult to get out of the box. Now, as we have told you before, really this is one of the thinnest bezels that comes on the market. Uh, the device is extremely lightweight without the battery inside, a beautiful thin profile uh, with the improved aesthetic of it mimicking a metal on the side. And what else is in the box for you? Okay. So more instruction manuals and warranties and things of that nature. We have a handbooken, a kuzer lectin, obviously a micro USB cable, typical Samsung white plastic. And here we have the headphones. Now we're going to pay closer attention to these because headphones are actually a really important part of the device. So we'll be taking a closer look at these in just a moment. And here's the nice beefy 2600 milliamp battery, which is a nice improvement on the Galaxy S3 and competing devices on the market. And it looks like we have been given a power cord that is uh, specified for a European market, which is fine. Some more earbuds and nothing really else. So let's take a look at the headphones here. I know headphones are something that I burn through a lot of. Um, let's try and get these open here. <laughs> All right, proven to be a little more challenging than I had anticipated. <laughs> My gosh. There we go. So actually interesting. So what we're having here, just to pay attention, we have a microphone here, as you can see on the side. And it's really nice. We have a double click or a single click. So if you're going to be uh, exercising or running, you're going to be able to change your music. And we also have an up and down volume rocker. Now the earbuds themselves are very, very similar actually. Uh, it looks like the drivers have been increased in size, at least the size of them. Uh, and we're going to be using a typical plastic earbud. Uh, but it has a variety of different sizes, so for those of you that have different ears, that's going to be nice. And it looks like we're looking at a uh, sort of a beat style, um, a ribbon um, flattened type cord, which as we know it tends to be a lot more durable um, just than the thin rounded style. So, Hopefully these are going to be a lot more durable than what we experienced with the Galaxy S3. But either way, good stuff here. Yeah, it looks like they put some thought into it, so I have to commend Samsung for that. Now with regards to the device itself, as you can see, now I used to own the Galaxy Note 2 and I'm thinking about switching it up because there's so many great devices coming out on the market, but uh, my main pet peeve essentially was that I was unable to access most of the device with one hand, and as you can see, uh, this really is virtually perfect. Um, so much screen, such a thin bezel, I really, really have to hand it to Samsung. So here we are, taking a closer look. Let's just open it up at the back here. Should have taken the plastic off there. Either way, guys, that's where the battery's going to go. Obviously, we have the memory card and this micro SIM slot. We have a speaker in the rear. So, that's what we're looking at for the Galaxy S4. This is our first unboxing from Android Authority. My name is Darcy Lacuve. We're here with Android Authority. If you like what we do, we have tons of great videos coming up all the time. So don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and let us know how we're doing in the comments. Thanks a lot, guys.